These boxes have become like my favorite thing that I do every month. Hey guys, my name is here. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are reviewing the March Copacetic Cosmetics Cuties Box. Um, I've actually like really started to like this brand. I had no like future knowledge of it before. I was just like, oh my gosh, they have a subscription box. Let's do this for the year of subscription box. Um, I don't know why I said that word both times really funny, but how these videos normally go. We have five products, three I kind of know-ish about. I don't think I curated this box. It has a little paper that's gonna tell me, so it's fine. Um, but normally it's like a nail, a lip, an eyeshadow, and then some other little product, which we love. Um, the last one was this Dino Dumped Dry Body Oil, which I love. It smells so sweet. It's not sticky, and I kind of like will rub it on like my elbows and my knees because it's kind of get ashy on me, and I feel like this has helped a lot. <laughs> um, but that aside, I really like it. And I've just found so many different products that I would not have known about before, and so I don't know. I just I'm really starting to like it. It's really cute. Um, anyway, we have a piece of paper that has my little coupon on it. I think, okay, so it says, like, the coupon code has something to do with, like, garden, so I'm guessing this was, like, a garden box. Yeah, it says right here it wasn't customized, so <laughs> that's that's because I forgot. Like, I'm gonna be honest, girl, like, I forgot, but it's okay. I'm sure you picked the most amazing things. So there's eyeshadow, lip, and a nail that we already know about. The eyeshadow is called Green Thumb. Lip is Greenhouse. Nail is Wheelbarrow, so it was, like, a garden theme. I love the different themes. Last month's was, like, a dino theme. It was so cute. Anyway, it's like, I love, this is like the little box. Okay, so like, I love that it's packed like this because it helps it so much, but like, they get everywhere in my room because I'm a little monster and I don't know how to open it correctly. Um, but it normally has like that much on top. <laughs> and then, kind of see what we got. We got little goodies. I love them kind of being hidden in here though because I feel like I'm like, digging in the sand for them and it's so cute okay so this is greenhouse Ooh, um where is last month's little okay that was just my little vanity so this was last month and it was another green one and it was blushing bronto and this was the color so i i really like the color green like i really do so i find this just adorable so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on because why not Oh, that's beautiful. I've never had like a green shipper before. It reminds me of just like the clear glosses I would get. They just have like a little shimmer on it. That is really pretty on the lips. It's not even green, like girl. And you can see my acne, but like, she's cute. This is really cute. I'm gonna be wearing this every day. Because it's so subtle and it's just glossy and it looks kind of like wet and it's... This is really pretty. Um, this is the next one. This is Wheelbarrow. I can't tell if this is blue or white. Or maybe it's gray. I'm a bit colorblind, but that's fine. Oh, it's definitely a gray. I will... My nails are so ugly right now because I just don't have my extensions on. Um, I've been doing the poly gel extensions. I like them a lot. Um, that's the color. It's a pretty gray. Um, I'm probably gonna put on my poly gels and I'm probably gonna end up wearing this color around. But I've really, really begun to love these nail polishes that I've been getting. The past two were like a glitter. One was like a pink glitter and then the other one was, which I picked it. It was like this green and pink glitter that had a little heart glitters in it. And so... This is my first solid color. That's what she looks like. She's fine. She has one layer on. Could probably double layer. But she's cute. And I think she's already dry. That's wild. Um, but I really like their nail polish. Next. Ooh. I love the color green. So this is the eyeshadow Green Thumb. 
again, I keep saying I'm going to get the little cat thing because I have like four of these now and they're just, they have to sit in the cases until I can get the little magnetic board and I can put these in. So, let's see here. Do -do -do. Ooh, this would be pretty for like a poison ivy cosplay. That is really pretty. I'm going to put it on my little eyes, give myself some little green moment. It's a very subtle shimmer. And I think it's fun. Like I'm already wearing like, I guess this is more of like a mint. It looks more green in person, but it looks blue on camera. Either way, we're going to just tap in some of this green. And another thing I love about these products, they don't hurt my eyes because some products do hurt my eyes. I am dapping in a little bit more than usual because I'm not like pressing in too hard, but I guess probably I should. There we go. Because with this finger, you can see how green it is because I just went in and this one I had to go into. But she's cute. She's very subtle. She's very light green. I like it. It's very like unique colors because I would have never picked up that green. I would have been like, mm, like my favorite color is green, but it might not look pretty on me. But they're very subtle, but they can be built upon. Probably not the lipstick. I mean, unless it does get greener, let's see. I'm gonna add another coat and see if it tints more. Mm, not really, which is fine. I'm okay with not having green lips. I don't think I could rock them as well as other people probably could. But I do like this little green shadow. I think that these little pressed pigments have been the best things in the boxes. They're very pretty. I think there was a foil one too. Um, but they're very light, they're very pretty, and they look very glam, in a sense, too. They're not too much, they're not too less. I think it's very pretty. My eyes, you can see, I was out in the rain this morning. You can see, like, my eyeliner isn't in my inner corners anymore. Um, and for our last, um, mystery gift. That's so pretty. This is a highlighter. It's perfect. <laughs> I love cats. It's perfect glow highlighter, field of flowers, and it has a little paw print. It goes up. Where's my beautiful little highlighter brush? We're gonna dip into it. Ooh, she's got some fallout, but baby, it's okay. Whew. I I did not need to use as much as I did. Cause I'm still going. And I really didn't use a whole lot. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Okay. So there is a bit of fallout, which is fine. Um, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna take my little normal brush. And I'm gonna like fix it a little bit cause I went heavy in the highlighter. And I like a, I like to look like a disco ball, don't get me wrong. Um, just touch. <laughs> this is my like just regular face powder. Okay, it really shows up on my nose. It does have like a light to it. Let's try this again. Okay. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. It does have like a little white pigment to it, which is fine. I like a little white moment. Very subtle, very cute. That is actually very blinding and I think I love it. So. Don't mind me, I did have to like retry it because you don't need a whole lot of this highlighter. Like it shows up, she's cute, she's there, she's wet. I like the wet look. Um, but I went in so heavy handed that I had to like take it off and try again. Um, so that's on me. That's, that's not my fault that this works amazing and does a better job than what I thought I was going to. That's why I went in so deep because I'm used to highlighters. You have to go in deep and then like really keep going with it. This didn't need that. This needed a light tap and to just go on the face. So that's good. Um, I love just the color, like the swirl, just the weird green. There's some pink in there and then the white. Um, so yeah, these are my five products. We had a lip, highlighter, eyeshadow, and a nail polish. Okay, so doing a little recap. We had the white, gray. I'm so colorblind, it looks blue now. Um, the Wheelbarrow shade. I believe that is gray. I don't know. It's a very cute color though. It's very like, almost smoky maybe? Like, it, 
I'm having like the blue and black, the white and gold dress thing all over again on my nail because I need to get tested. I need to get a colorblind test and we just need to know what I can't see. But this is really pretty. <laughs> it's a really pretty color. Like I said, it was my first solid color from them. And I, like I said, I've really just been loving the nail polishes I've been receiving. Um, we have the green eyeshadow. Again, I've really been loving these eyeshadows. And I think that they're very subtle, but they also could be used more buildable and more intensely for like a cosplay or something because it gave me poison ivy feels like that's um that wasn't even me like digging too deeply like on my eyes i patted in there this was me just doing a streak and it's so like dark so i think that it could be really pretty um and that it has multiple little uses for that so we have the greenhouse lip gloss really been loving the lip glosses again i know i'm just like oh i love it but like i haven't had a bad box from them yet like i've i've done like ipsy and other different subscription boxes um during my time on youtube and this is the first one that it's been like hit after hit after hit and i didn't even customize this one so i didn't even get really a say on what was going to be in it um because i was lazy that's on me they they sent an email and be like hey customize your box i was lazy <laughs> that has nothing to do with them um but yeah, like this is really pretty. It's very juicy looking, very glossy. It looks green. I thought it was going to be wild. But like it's it's a very pretty lip gloss. And I can't get over that. And then lastly, we have the different product. This was the highlighter. I used way too much of this because I didn't realize that it was just a little swoosh and it would be there. That's on me, um, and that's why I like getting different products of theirs because I'm getting to try them out and I get to know that hey, don't go heavy handed into the highlighter because it will just there will be just too much and you'll have to kind of like wipe it off and try again. Um, I also I just love the cat theme, maybe that's I'm just biased because I love cats, like that's that's what it is. I just love this brand because of cats. Um, like I said, the only thing there was a little bit of fallout on mine, but also I did dig in pretty heavy handed so maybe that's why it was maybe if i would have just done a very light tap nothing would have fallen out so that could be user error but look how cute it is um so this is my i believe this was the march one because my april one is being sent now um this was my little march i love all the green um my little march copacetic copacetic i can never say that right whenever i go to film um but the copacetic cosmetics cutie box i've really been loving it i'm looking forward to my next subscription box so that being said that's the end of the video thank you so much for watching just a little fun trying out a new subscription box trying out a little lipstick a little highlighter with that said thank you for watching leave a like comment subscribe if you're new here if you're not new here turn on the bell to be notified every time i upload which is every monday and friday and i'll see y'all next time bye